everyone. Hope you are doing well. So I went to a campsite in Satargaon yesterday. There's a new campsite in Satargaon and one of my friends got an invite for the opening. He asked me to come along with him. So I have been to Satargaon a couple of times but I never had an experience of camping there. It was a very good experience for me and the campsite was good as well. Uh, I did make a short video of my travel to the village and the campsite. So I thought I will share it with you guys. Just check it out. Satargaon village is located around 30 kilometers from Guwahati. If you are coming from Jalukbari, once you reach Rani Gate, you have to go straight. A few kilometers ahead, you will notice this small boat pointing towards the village. Take a left from here. Yeah, so it's not raining here, uh, so I have stopped here on this road. Once you take the left from the main road, this road directly leads to the Satargaon village. I came here a couple of times but I never made any video on this road. Let's see if I can take some drone shots today. Traveling through this road surrounded by nature is a beautiful experience in itself. Camp Tusker Trail is a part of Stay High Adventures. Stay High Adventures have been organizing camping, trekking and other adventure activities across the Northeast India. I will leave a link of their social media profiles in the description so that you can check their activities and contact them as well. They have lined up different activities for the visitors, which include a trek to the waterfall as well. Let me show you around the campsite now. The camping area has been beautifully set up on the base of this hill. One of the things I liked about this was that you can go for a short hike to the top of the hill as well. <laughs> and now it was time to officially open oh, the
Tantor agot kene goyen nasung. Ajay. Ayah. For the opening of the campsite, they have invited all the people from the village. After having our food, we went out to explore few parts of the village as well. As the day was full of other activities, they decided to take everyone for the trek to the waterfall in the morning. I woke up around 5 in the morning. As most of them were still sleeping, I found the perfect people to pass my morning time. Once everyone was awake, we all had our breakfast together and then it was time to go for the trek to the waterfall. From this point, there is a trek of around 3.5 km through the forest to reach the beautiful waterfall. I have been to the waterfall a couple of times and I have made a few videos of the trek to the waterfall as well. As I had some other work, I have to skip the trek this time and part my ways from here. This beautiful waterfall is called Kyopani Waterfall and I will leave a link of those videos in the description so that you can check the track for the waterfall as well. Well, that was it for today's video. I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to our channel if you like our videos.